Hey there guys, how's it going? And what we're going to be talking about today is the Dell Computer Mouse MS111-P model type. Okay, yeah. I like this mouse. It's very basic, very, very simple. It has, it's by Dell, of course, and the model type is MS111-P, yes. And it has two buttons, just the side, two sides, and the middle with the scrolling center wheel. Yeah, that's all I need, <laughs> okay? I've seen mice that have buttons all around and scrolling balls and all these kind of, I mean, and they're super cool to, you know, to do whatever you're gonna do, depends on what kind of jobs you're doing, but, I just find it uh, a little unnecessary for what I need. If you're just scrolling the internet, you're, say, maybe opening up pages, deleting files, maybe scrolling through pictures, or reading things, you know, just basically scrolling, deleting, you know, and say, and if you're not doing anything that requires like all kind of multi-functions and, and simultaneous actions or things like that, this kind of mouse will do you just fine. It, it, it really will. I mean, m most people only need a mouse to do just what this one does. And they're very, this one is very reliable. Reliable. I've had it for probably a good, maybe four years now, and it is just fine with me. And what I am preference to is a mouse with a cord on it. Now, I don't think that it's the popular opinion <laughs> because I, you know, I think people probably like their freedom to move their mouse around as much as they want and not have to worry about a cord. But I absolutely, I absolutely uh, despise a wireless mouse because I've had such uh, bad experiences with uh, a wireless mouse with the battery dying on me on the very worst of times, you know, and it's just annoying. And if you don't have another battery to to replace it, it's, man, I mean, it could really, really make you crazy. And I mean, you, you there's nothing you can do besides uh, get your shoes on and your jacket and go to the store and go get another battery <laughs> if you don't have one in your house before you can finish doing whatever you're doing but hopefully you will have one of these around hopefully that you can just plug in and it's fine you know it's uh it's just my preference i mean i've had that happen so many times it's just ridiculous so the last time it happened to me i vowed just i'm not gonna do it anymore i just gonna get a nice wired mouse that will do me just fine for the things I need to do. Yeah. So I got the Dell and this Dell works really well. It's really smooth wheel motion. It it pretty much works on almost any surface as far as, you know, the um, eye here, you know, being able to detect the, the, um, the ground and move the cursor around. It, it it does what it's supposed to do. The um, the cord on it is at least five feet long. I mean, you have enough room to move your mouse around as much as you need to. It's a good mouse, and like I said, if you're just doing basic stuff on your computer, if you're not drawing or like doing a crazy amount of simultaneous work or playing some real fancy games or anything like that that need like all kind of multifunctional, you know, things like a joystick. Uh, I mean, not a joystick, but a, a, a control pad would on some gaming system. 
then this mouse will work just fine for you. It will, it, you will have no problems. And like I said, this one is pretty old and it's worked for me for a long time. This is the Dell model and it's, 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 it's a good mouse. You won't have any issues with it. And it plugs in just normally with, into the USB and it's fine. I've had no issues with it. The only color I've seen this in it was black or it's kind of like more like a, a super, super, super dark gray. Kind of looks almost black. But yeah, it works very well and I'm very, very happy with it. That's what it's supposed to do. Yeah, okay. Well, that is the Dell computer mouse MS111-P. Hope you guys use this information and I will see you next time. Okay, bye-bye.